Hello and good evening, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Sora Darkchild, and welcome to... Back to the story mode adventures of Let's Replay Crisis Core. Last time, we did all of these missions, mainly the last of these missions, except for 996. We we're saving that for a later date. So for the time being, until I get more missions, we're going to be continuing the story. And we already did half of the events that are needed to be done in Chapter 5, which we're currently on. Let us progress the story and see if we can finish this chapter. Always need to go into map mode to make sure I didn't miss anything. For every area I visit in Midgar. Because we're getting very close to the final chapter where you're in Midgar. And once you're in a certain town on a certain chapter of this uh, game, if you miss anything, it'll be too late to go back and do it now. Don't worry, we're two chapters away from it, I think. So we should be fine for the moment. I'm very positive that we did everything. I heard that you Shinra soldier guys are trying hard to get rid of the monsters. I guess that's how this friend of mine was able to get out of Midgard, safe and sound. My friend is amazing! He travels around the world, looking for rare items and stuff. He keeps a record of his travels, which he calls his struggle log. It's the funniest thing I've ever read! Okay, kid. And there's another child that I need to report to before heading to the, uh, what is it? The church. And I think there's a person we need to talk to at the playground. Which, for some reason, doesn't show on the map. That's great news. You'd better thank that soldier guy, huh? Yeah. So this uncle of yours, what's he like? Uncle always wears really nice clothes. He's stylish. His house is up in Wall Market. Inside his house, everything's all shiny and golden. He told me that his job is being a Don. A Don? That's a strange job name. That's kind of a red flag. Now, is there anybody I need to talk to at the park? Yes, there is. You're really lucky. I'm a member of the premier hardcore Sephiroth fan club, the Silver Elite. Sephiroth's premier fan club? Our fan club is the stuff of legend. Only a select few are chosen to be members. We only recruit twice a year. You should consider it a miracle that you got this chance. Huh. All right. Now let's begin the entrance exam. Hey, wait a minute. I never said that I wanted to join. Question one. What is the name of Sephiroth's beloved sword? That's easy. Hurry up and answer! You're running out of time! It's called the Masamune. Correct! Question 2. What is Sephiroth's ultimate attack? Supernova. Correct! Question 3. Which is Sephiroth's dominant hand? Left hand. Correct! Well done! You are now a chosen member of the Silver Elite Fan Club. Oh, your first male. 
We will probably have to check back on her later. Now let's go see Eric. Best not keep her waiting. Get that out of the way. Don't want that distracting me later. Zack, I need you in Modeoheim. I know. Just give me a minute. Aerith isn't there. Mm. Problem? And how is it you know Aerith? It's complicated. Really? Did she tell you anything? Not a thing. Then, I won't either. Whatever, I guess. Whatever. That doesn't sound good. Oh boy, they had a, a helicopter crash. Hope everyone's okay. Well, that's a fine how do you do. Song! Hey guys! No signal out here. Well, at least we're all in one piece. We'll be all right. Thankfully, we have someone used to this kind of terrain. Yeah, yeah, I'm a country boy. All right then. We would have reached Modeoheim by now if we hadn't crashed. So, we're going to need to make up for lost time. All right, follow me then. Okay, no new missions, that's a good thing. And if we try looking at the map, you get nothing but static since Sung said on his cell phone there's no surface up here. So, we're pretty much going in blind here. Activating combat mode. Oh, yeah. Only resolved. Whoops, uh, did I forget to check my materia? Yes, I did. Uh, yeah, that should do. Because we're at level 99, and have all these powerful materials, we're pretty much way too OP for the rest of the story. Yo! Don't fall too far behind! At least someone's keeping up. Well, I'm a country boy too. From where? Nibelheim. How about you? Me? Gungaga. <laughs> hey, what's so funny about that? You know Gungaga? No, but it's such a backwater name. Ditto Nibelheim. Like you've been there. I haven't, but there's a reactor there, right? 
A Mako reactor outside Midgar usually means nothing, nothing else out there. Oh. <laughs> Good news, Song! Me and... Cloud. Me and Cloud here are both backwater experts. Oh yeah! Good. Carry on then. They certainly made fast. And it took me long enough to sh get Cloud to show up here. It took me about, what, 24 episodes to get to him? Okay. Activating now then. Combat mode. Out of the way, birdies. Oh, combat yeah! Resolved. Now. Still nothing on this, uh, thing here. Which means I can only go right from here. Guess I'll wait. Hey, uh, Zack? Hmm? Um, so, soldier, what's it like? Huh? Uh, I'm not getting the question. Uh... Well, you'll know once you join up. <sighs> if I can join. Don't worry. If I can do it, you can. <laughs> Cloud, look. It's Genesis. That's a Mako excavation test site. Okay, check it out. Now for one of the least favorite, well, one of two of my least favorite nuts. parts of this game. Engaging Genesis was not expected. Not expected, so just let them be? Unreal. In any case, we need more intel. It's possible that a larger force is hiding inside the building. How's this then? I go first, avoiding combat if possible and sneak inside. Then, I take a look around. If I can take them, I will. If not, I'll bolt. Hmm. Come on, man. I'll prove that Soldier isn't just a bunch of mindless thugs. <laughs> All right. The entrance is behind that warehouse. Make your way in from there. Gotcha! I'm sure you know, but it'll be cold. Mind your body temperature. If you stop moving, your body temp will go down. To get it back up, just do your usual thing. Oh, that! Good idea! Oh boy. Here we go. The first of two events that are my least favorite in video games. Stealth missions. We gotta be stealthy for this one. And don't worry, if you fail to get the items that you're uh, looking for in this uh, stealth mission, don't worry, you could get them in missions if you haven't done them yet. Every time you get caught and f 
fight, you'll lose one treasure in this area. This is pretty much what they've been telling me to do. Okay, so L to crutch, and X to perform a squat to keep myself from freezing. All that I needed to know, so... Stay down. Wait for that guy to pass, and we get our first item. Now hurry back to that hidey hole. Zack! What are you doing? I need to time this very, very carefully for how I want to do this. Damn it! I got spotted! Which means goodbye to that one treasure. Activating combat mode. Goodbye to that one, treasure. Dispel. I already got Dispel. Guess I'll grab that quick and then, uh have to go into another fight, which makes me lose another treasure chest in there. Activating combat mode. Oh Contact yeah! Contact resolved. Pearl necklace. Small potatoes. Well, three out of five treasures ain't so bad. Though I could have done better on the stealth. Oh well. Like I said in previous games before this one, stealth is not my strong suit. So, now we're in the uh, reactor. Which means I gotta look around and see if there's anything worth taking. Any treasure. Oh, yeah. Perhaps off screen I'll farm some uh, fusion material from the enemies here. Might be worth it. But that's entirely up to you. And far as I know, that's the only treasure chest down this way. What's the other way? and a save point. No other treasure chest. Activating combat mode. Oh Contact yeah. Contact resolved.
What's the meaning of this? You need me, Genesis. Remember that. If you get rid of me, who's going to stop the degradation? The Genova cells. Stop! Cloud! Good work! For about five seconds. Nobody knows where the Genova cells are being kept. Not even Hojo knows. You'll never find it. Then I shall willingly accept my fate. But I'll take the world with me. Cloud! Go! You're not getting any luck. Any of that. Take that! Conflict resolved. Dreams of the morrow. Half the shattered soul. Pride is lost. Wings stripped away. The end is nigh. Such is the fate of a monster. We're not monsters, you hear me? We're soldier. Where's your honor? <sighs> Even if the morrow is barren of promises, nothing shall forestall my return. If this world seeks my destruction, it goes with me. Genesis. Genesis has been added to the DMW. And that leaves one more thing to be added to the DMW. Genesis mode is a separate thing on the DMW. He shows up at random on there, and his limit break when you get him is called the Apocalypse. Or Apocalypse Alone. Do I see a treasure chest back there? Song? Cloud? Where are they? Hmm? What is that hole? Did they go in? I'll check that in a second. Nah, I was just seeing things. Let's go. Welcome to Mildeoheim. Let's see. Now the map is working.
I'll check that in a moment. Activating combat mode. Oh Contact yeah! Contact result. Grab all the treasure chests you can find. I got plenty of those. And you're gonna want to grab that. What's this then? Boiler handle. Activating combat mode. Resolved. And there are a lot of mission uh, messages on that answering machine for some reason. Looks like I have some voicemail messages. Let's listen to all of them, shall we? You have 23 messages. Message 1. Oh, wait. You guys are closed? Another time, I guess. Message two. Hey, party of eight for tomorrow. Oh, it's voicemail. Three. Message three. My stomach's been hurting ever since I had those drinks at your place. What gives? I'm gonna sue. Four. Message four. I left my bag there, I think. Can you check for me? Five. Message five. You're still closed. You didn't go out of business, I hope. Six. Message six. Are there any front row seats left? Seven. Message seven. It's closed. Eight. Message eight. T-Day is coming up. Make sure you're open then. Understand? Nine. Message nine. Please answer our questionnaire and we'll... Ten. Message ten. Can we rent your place for a private party? Eleven. Message eleven. You've still got the package over there in the store, right? Worst case, the deal's still on, even if you ain't open for business. Twelve. Message, twelve. This is the recycling service. We're calling to ask what time you want us to come by for pickup. Thirteen. Message, thirteen. Sorry about this, but we have to move D-Day. I'll call you in the new data set. 14. Message 14. If you're closing for good, what's gonna happen to my personal bottle? 15. Message 15. Did you close up the spa too? 16. Message 16. I went over and it was closed. What's going on? 17. Message 17. There's been some trouble. The deal's off. You're not gonna be able to reach me for a while. 18. Message 18. Hi, I have a reservation for tomorrow. I'm really looking forward to it. 
19. Message, 19. I heard you're closed for renovations. When's the reopening? 20. Message, 20. This is the Shinra Tourist Bureau. We're calling today to inquire about reusing your facilities. 21. Message, 21. Looks like I won't be able to pick up the package. I'm sorry, but you're gonna have to get rid of it for me, all right? 22. Message, 22. Oh, uh, I'm sorry, wrong number. And finally, message 23. Message, 23. I'm sure you already know. The location of the package is inside the trunk next to the stage. Okay. There's something in the trunk. Power wrist. Does that mean he's here? Yes, Zack. It'd be very obvious for that. Now we can get that treasure chest, but we're gonna have to do some backtracking if we're gonna get that treasure chest in the, uh, in the spa. Oh, yeah. Right now, the water's too hot for us. Hey! Cloud, come on! I'm okay. Song! Song! Up ahead, you have to catch Hollander. And Geo is waiting for you. He'll just have to wait a little bit longer as I'm busy collecting treasure. There's that, but I was after another thing in here. There. That there is a slot for something. Not a bad track for two treasures we can get now that the steam is off. Activating combat mode. Down, doggies. Oh, combat yeah. resolved. Yeah. 
lightning armlet. And what was inside that spa that we couldn't get because the heat was on. Bell. Okay. Doesn't hurt to have another. Now let's go see about Angeal. Save point if you need it. Activating combat mode. This fight up ahead used to give me a lot of trouble as a kid. Now, I feel like I know what I'm doing. should have been me. I should have dealt with Genesis. Yeah. Then why'd you send me? To prepare you for your next fight. Have you lost it? <laughs> Stop it! Someone's waiting for you, no? Angeal, don't do this. Very good, Angeal. It is time to exact vengeance for our family's suffering. Family? No! My father is dead! <laughs> Fine. Then do it for your mother. My mother's shame made her take her own life! <sighs> shame? How terribly misguided. She should have been proud. Proud that she was the namesake of our experiment. Project G, or should I say, Project Jillian? Ugh. Don't say her name. <sighs> Jillian, the woman implanted with Genova cells. Genesis, who had her genes mapped onto him during the fetal stage. Yes, Genesis was a failure. I'll admit it. But you, Angeal, you were actually bred inside Jillian's body. You... You are perfection. Ugh. Zack, I am perfect. A perfect... monster. My cells can absorb genetic traits and pass them along to others. A two-way conduit. Genova's power has passed on to you completely. <sighs> Zack... Do you remember what I said about our enemy being all that creates suffering? Yeah, but you're not one of them. But I created my own suffering. Zack, let me show you. Stop it! You don't know what you're doing! At least one sample!
given to honor! Activating combat mode. I won't use magic on you. It might end this quick, but I don't care. Oh good, it went into Genesis mode. I can use Apocalypse now if I wanted to. Gotta make the finale of this chapter last. And unfortunately, this is the finale, this fight. And all I'm doing is just whacking away at him with my sword. And I'll be quiet because this is very emotional. Zack, you have my thanks. This is for you. <laughs> Protect your honor always. Embrace your dreams. If you want to be a hero, you need to have dreams and honor. is closer in the city above, right? Kinda scary, but the flowers might like it, maybe. They're a really couple. <laughs> Where'd he get that other cut from? Was it during the fight? So you want to be in Soldier? Hang in there. 
So, is everybody here now? Sir! You're all rookies, right? Sir! Yes, sir! One piece of advice. No. An order. Embrace your dreams. And, whatever happens, protect your soldier honor. Got it? Sir! We're all coming back here alive. You hear me? Let's go. And thus concludes Chapter 5 of Crisis Core. When we come back, we will be doing Chapter 6 of, of Crisis Core. I hope you enjoyed today's episode. If you did, hit that like and subscribe button. Leave a comment if you want. Ring the bell to be notified when our next video comes out. We do new videos every Tuesday, Thursday and occasionally Saturday and Sundays. Till the next video, this is Sword Archild, signing off. Have a good night, folks.